So let's take a look at this question. We're told point O is the center of the circle above and the measure of angle OAB is 30 degrees. We're then asked, if the length of OC is 18, what is the length of arc AB? Well, so the first thing we should do for any geometry question is we should first label the parts that we're given, right? So we're given that angle OAB is 30, right? And then we're also given that the length of OC is going to be 18. So what we should then do is try to fill in anything else we can, right? So length of AO is also going to be 18 and so will the length of OB and the reason why is because all of these are radiuses which means they're all equal then because AO and OB are equal in length angle B needs to equal angle A right so that's also 30 so finally we can find the angle of O because it has to add up with these two 30s to be 180 so that would then be 120 now what we can do is we have to take the circumference of the circle and multiply it by the angle of the arc over 360. So what's the circumference? That's going to be 2 pi r. And so the angle of the arc is going to be this 120 degrees, right? Because it's this arc that we're talking about. So times 120 over 360, right? And so what's 2 pi r? Well, our radius is 18. So we're going to have 36 pi times 120 over 360 is one third. So we're just going to have it be 12 pi. And so our answer is going to be b. For more SAT help, check out the YouTube video down below.